Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be all about my bridesmaids dresses. I'm so excited to finally continue the wedding series and basically just bring you guys along because this year is the wedding year. I cannot believe it. We are about four months away from the wedding. It is literally going to fly by. I really want to share everything wedding related and just the wedding process overall with you guys. So today we're focusing on the bridesmaids dresses, which I know can be a little bit stressful since there's a lot out there and it's just hard to choose from. But I am partnering up with Revelry. Today's video is sponsored by Revelry and they honestly have the best quality when it comes to dresses. But anyways, I'm going to be sharing with you guys the color that we're going for before I mention it leave me your suggestions or I guess what you assumed that I was going to choose from all of these right here I got their home try on box to try different dresses different colors and see exactly what will go with my wedding and my style and also with my wedding dress so without further ado let's jump right into the video all right so where do I begin because I actually started testing out different colors back in I believe April is when I started truly diving into it so April last year so I got this free little sample with all the colors and fabrics that they offer. It's just so much easier to actually see and feel the fabric. I don't know if you can sell there. And if you're even more indecisive than I am, you can also get the actual fabric samples so you can get a feel for them. Straight off the bat, I knew that I wanted satin material, even though sometimes, I have to admit, it could be a little bit tricky, but I find it to be the most elegant and just like, I don't know, just so, timeless so that's what we went for we went for satin material so i ended up getting these two samples in green this one is their silver sage and then this is their deep olive i am obsessed with the deep olive i have to admit it looks darker on screen than it does in person it's just the most beautiful deep olive ever if i would be having a late summer or fall wedding i would a hundred percent choose this color so i ended up sticking to the silver sage but I was also in between the gold champagne, which is absolutely stunning and I feel like it will look beautiful in Dominican Republic. Either of these would go really well with our decor and also just our style and what we're going for. I genuinely didn't know which one to choose and that's why it took me so long because I ordered these back in April and it's been almost a year. But you guys know that I am a neutrals girl through and through, so I had to go for the gold champagne. It's just, you know, very muted and monotone, and I feel like it will look so beautiful with the decor. So yeah, I ended up going for the gold champagne in satin. I have two different dresses to try on for you guys in that specific color, and then I basically allowed the girls to choose any style that they wanted in the satin fabric. Uh, because they do have different styles depending on the fabric. I know traditionally bridesmaids tend to wear the same exact style and dress, but I basically wanted them to feel comfortable with the actual dress, so I allowed them to choose whichever one fit their style and whichever one they actually felt comfortable in, so they're all wearing different dresses in the satin fabric. But yeah, I am now in the process for them to order their dresses in time for our wedding because one of the things that I love about Revelry is that you can actually get them made to order, so each girl is going to be getting them perfect for their size and height, which is a 10 out of 10 for me because personally, I have such a hard time finding dresses my proper length um, since I'm 5'9 so I would get like the I think they have an extra long or a long option rather than a regular so they have petite regular and long but these are other fabrics that I ordered this beautiful blush champagne in the chiffon material this is sand in chiffon I was also considering chiffon I have to admit because it is I feel like easier when it comes to getting dirty because satin it's a tricky one. It's a tricky one, especially in Dominican Republic with, you know, sweating, drinking, uh, lotion. You just have to be really careful with it. So that's why I was considering chiffon rather than satin, but I find satin to be the most elegant. This one is in taupe. It's such a beautiful color. Also taupe, but in satin. Latte, desert rose, and lastly, mist gray in their tool fabric. Something else that I love is the fact that they are size inclusive. So all of their styles are 0 to 32 and selective styles are 0 to 36. And they offer over a hundred different colors and materials. So you get a really nice selection to choose from. All right, so now I'm going to be trying on my try on box for you guys so you can see all the different styles. All right, I had to pull my clothing rack for this one because 
I just have to show you guys how stunning is the little palette that I chose. They have a lot more colors, obviously, but this is definitely more my palette. So we have 10 different styles to try on, but look at the detail. Like, how beautiful, even on their hanger. I love it, and I love that it's wood. I'm not gonna lie, I think I wanna ask them <laughs> if I can keep these so that I can put the girl's name here with my Cricut. Cute idea. All right, so starting with this one, this one is in the color Soft Champagne, I believe, so lighter than the Gold Champagne, which is the one I'm going for. It's a classic, beautiful style, has a nice slit detail, nice V-cut detail, overlay detail. I just love, love, love this one. It has adjustable straps, and like I mentioned, I am 5'9", so I usually have a really hard time finding dresses that are my length, and even though these are all regular, these fit me really amazing lengthwise. I would personally get them in a long for the made to order, but this size right now is perfect for me. I don't know if I mentioned it, but they're all in a size four. Next is the gold champagne, which is going to be the color for the bridesmaids. I am obsessed with this style and this dress. This one is in the style sky. I'm going to list the names up here for you guys as well and also in the description. I have to admit this is one of my favorites. I feel like it's just so classic and so elegant. I love the little cowl detail right here or scoop detail and it has two openings on the sides right here. One of my bridesmaids is actually wearing this one which I'm excited for. Next in the gold champagne, I know I keep saying that they're my favorites but this one, the fit, 10 out of 10. I I'm obsessed with this one. It has a beautiful slit and it's obviously one shoulder. The straps are adjustable. I love the rouging right here. It's just so flattering. Oh my God, something else that I need to mention. I love the fact that these are double layered just because I feel like satin dresses could be a little bit tricky sometimes depending your body type. But the fact that these are double layered and they also have um, cups like pre-built inside is amazing. Next up is this one in the color copper, which is so beautiful. It has a cowl detail or scoop detail right here, some buttons and a slit. Um, and the straps are adjustable as well. This color is so, so stunning and I feel like it would be so flattering on so many different skin tones. Moving on with Desert Rose. This one is another beautiful color. Um, I love the V-cut detail. It has some nice rouge detail right here on the side and a slit. So I feel like it's like a mixture of the third and the first together. Next in the same color is this beautiful one that has some detail up here and then it's just straight down. Um, let me see if it has a slit. Yes, this one has a slit on, oh, on both sides. So it has a slit on both sides. It comes with the regular adjustable straps and then a second one to do like a little bow detail. I just find it to be really romantic. All right, on to my second choice for the color. This one is in the Silver Sage. So stunning. Um, I also love this style. This is in Ariel. I believe it's a convertible so you can remove the um, straps if you want. You can put it off the shoulders. You can put it like regular up here um, or just wear it um, strapless. And then some rouging on the side and I believe a slit. Yes, it has two slits. One slit, one slit. Also in the Silver Sage is this beautiful one that has like this overlapping fabric. It adds like a nice romantic flowy feel to it. Um, you can wear the sleeves different ways. So you can wear it with the regular straps, also with this up here in your shoulders or with this under your arms. So I just love this one. It's just really flowy and comfortable feel. Another color I loved is the Cinnamon Rose. This is such a beautiful color and also such a beautiful style. Very similar to the first one. Very flowy and romantic. Um, and yeah, it doesn't have a slit or anything. It's just really classic. Um, and I think it's such a perfect bridesmaids dress. Last but not least is this stunning, I feel like the most different and unique style that I've seen for bridesmaids dresses. It's just a strapless, straight, cut type look. It has a built-in bra inside and the most beautiful detail in the back. It has some button details right here and then a scoop detail in the back. But yeah, that was pretty much all the styles that I ended up getting for my at-home try-on box. I 100% recommend it. If you guys are in the fence 
for what you want your bridesmaids to wear. You can also order these yourself. That way you can try them on at home. They also came out with some more styles in the satin family. I believe in other materials as well, but in the satin family in particular, my best friend got one of the new styles which is like the um, scoop one. I'm going to try to insert a photo right here, but it's such a stunning dress and it's new for their 2023 collection. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Let me know what else you want to see in the wedding series. All the links will be in the description box. Revelry was kind enough to give us a discount code, so definitely take advantage if you are a bridesmaid or a bride-to-be looking for bridesmaid dresses. 100% recommend. They also have flower girl dresses and mother of the bride dresses. So just go and browse. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and until next time. Bye!